Hey everyone, welcome back to Elm Creek and another Mod Minute or so. So every once in a while, a tractor comes out that catches my eye a little bit more than the norm. And this JCB by a modder called My Game Steam is one of those tractors. Uh, I saw this tractor out on King Mods. It's also, uh, so it's available through there. I'll leave a download link in the description. This tractor <clears throat> ticks a lot of boxes for me. Uh, I think it just looks amazing. It's sporty. I've always been a fan of JCB tractors. And my game Steam has done a really nice job with adding several configuration items to it that make it uh, kind of special. So why don't we head on to the store and let's take a look at some of those configurations. So here we have the JCB Super Fast Track, starts at 289,000 euro. Engine range of 348 to 435 with a variable CVT engine, 43 miles an hour top speed. I think that's something like 75, 73 kilometers per hour. So here's the base model right here, 348 horsepower, looking pretty sharp. Then you've got some engine choices. We have the six cylinder 8.4 liter. We've got the six cylinder 8.7 liter. Attuned at 435 is your top one right there. That also adds this top air ventilated kind of scoop on the hood or for our European friends, the bonnet. Then we've got Tyler tire selections, trailer Borg Michelin, um, Continentals, Midas, BKT, Bridestein, and within those selections, pretty much the same, uh, standard, standard with wheel weights, rear twins, twin wheels all around, and back to standard. Midas, our Michelin, you add wheel weights, wide tires, so if you like the running the wides, you might want to go with, my, uh, with Michelin, keep saying Midas. Uh, wide tires with weights, rear twins, twins all around. Continentals give you standard wheel weights, rear twins, twins all around. Midas gives you standard wheel weights and standard, just those two options. BKTs, you've got wide tires, wide with weights, and that's it, just those two options. Some people prefer the BKT look. Bridestein, you've got standard wheel weights, rear twins, twins all around, and then back to Trailer Borg. If you want to add a little bit of secondary paint flare, which I personally really like, you can add that. You can see it adds that color accent to the uh, mirrors and some striping here on the front. Really, really, really sharp looking, in my opinion, of course. We've also got beacons, left and right, or both. Exhaust grill, if we come over here to the exhaust, you can add an exhaust grill pretty fancy we've also got a roof rack very very nice and of course with body colors you've got a wide selection of body colors you can add we can go jcb yellow if you want to go kind of stock maybe do a dark moon for the uh, added maybe i don't know what do you think blue do whatever you kind of like. Maybe a little green action. Exhaust grill also has options. You can make that orange if you want to match the rims. Change rim colors if you want as well. Something like that. Maybe we'll take our exhaust, exhaust color and match the rims like that. And of course, license plate option is available as well. Take a look here and you can see how it's to me it just looks pretty amazing pretty awesome looking little tractor maybe not so little let's fire it up and uh, give it a listen really nice job with the lights as well stock horn look in the interior Nicely done, kind of sporty.
this is definitely a tractor I plan on adding to my gameplay for sure. I just think it looks like the kind of tractor you add once you know you've made it. You know, you got that big bankroll. Now you can have some fun getting some bigger equipment, some sporty tractors. This thing would definitely be an eye catcher. Maybe a maybe a trailer runner back and forth to the silo and stuff. Very, very cool. <clears throat> like I said, this is from my game Steam. And I'll leave a download link in the description below. Give him some love. Leave some uh, comments. Tell him how much you enjoy his mods. He's got several mods now to pick from for FS22. So you might want to check out his homepage out on King Mods. I think he also has a home website. And I'll leave that link below as well. But thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoy this tractor as much as I do. Take care, and I'll see you soon.